Hello, everybody. Welcome to a special edition of AJ42K Productions. I am your host, AJ42K. Well, everybody, that time has finally come. My last workout was yesterday. Today is one final rest day. And tomorrow is the final race of the three the anchor race of the 2024 Olympic challenge of my lifetime. As I mentioned many times, I have not done this challenge since high school, half the age I am today. Half, half of my life ago, I was in high school track and field. I did three races in a calendar month since I was in high school track and field. The slowest on the team, the list goes on. Now twice the age I am from high school. I finished two races of my Olympic challenge of my lifetime. I got one more to go. The challenge is three races in 14 days, or should I say more of a calendar month, but this is three races in 14 days, which makes it even shocking, more shocking and much tougher. The recap I want to say is, is this, I started with a seven, sorry, July 7th, I had an eight mile run, July 14th, downgraded to 5k and then went a now to the 21st, which happens to be tomorrow is going to go back up to a 10k. Three races in 14 days. This is the Olympic month. This is year of the dragon. I'm both born on election year and a leap year, not the same day off the point. But all four do not happen very often, and it's an Olympic year. Tomorrow will be Olympic week, and tomorrow will also be the last race of the Olympic Challenge of my lifetime. I will be honest, this was not an easy task. I sacrificed a lot of stuff that I had to do to make it this far. I had to savor my birthday gift two months after my birthday, which happened to be this month, which is two months after my birthday. I had to sacrifice two months waiting for my birthday gift to save as much as I can, to do a challenge and to sacrifice as much as I had to do and give up some stuff that I had to do in order to be the man I wish I was 20 years ago. Well now, no longer being the slowest on the team, but now faster than all the bullies that I've had back in high school. Who's laughing now? Me. Well, everybody, it all comes down to this. Tomorrow's my final race of the challenge. Three races, 14 days. I'll be honest, going from bug infested to a bug infested race with an eight mile uphill, some, some, of, some of the race. Race two, oh, exactly a week later. Hot, pyro, caliente, Fire, Fira, Firaga, whatever you want to say, Pyro, it was. It was a 5K. Well, luckily, it was. And now, I just saw the weather for this race. Went from Omaha to Lincoln and back to Omaha now for this race in Omaha. The Summer Sizzler 10K. It's going to be perfect. Hope to God it stays that way. 64 degrees Sunday tomorrow the 21st in a, less than 24 hours. I'll be running my final race of the challenge. My 10 K time, the summer scissors of 15 K 10 K five K I'm doing the 10 K. My time to beat is one Oh three ten. My time prediction one Oh Oh 30 an hour, 30 seconds an hour, zero minutes, 30 seconds. If you want to be more specific, my goal is to get under an hour. It's gonna be just right. I've always told everybody when I'm running, with temperature wise, I'm Goldilocks, bitch. I'm a game, bitch. So being just right, this weather is gonna be just right for runners. 64 degrees to start the race. I wish this would have happened last week, but now the ante's up again. We go from eight mile on January, July 7th 
<sighs> 5K to July 14th, and then tomorrow the 21st is going to be back up again. Up, down, up, pretty much now to 10K. Johnny, if you're seeing this in prison, Johnny Spraybull, if you're seeing this in prison, this race is going to be for you, my friend. I know you can't see me. I know you can't. I know what you've been through, whatever it is. I'm sorry for what happened to you. But before my birthday in May, you saved my life. And for what you did for me that one day, Johnny, this race is for you, my friend. Johnny, whenever you get out of prison, three years, two years, one year, I'd love to celebrate with you and I have a drink on me on the way. For you saving my ass before early May of days before my birthday in my own car, I personally want to give you a thank you. You actually did a lot for me that day. You saved my life from a guy trying to attack me. That is what a real friend does. And I owe you and you have earned every respect possible. Congratulations, Johnny. I owe you big time. This race is for you, my friend. I didn't think I'd make it this far after having a bad June. And now July is already, already over halfway done. Tomorrow, Johnny Sprable, if you're seeing this right now, this race is definitely for you. After this challenge is over, everybody, once I finish this race, I'm going to be celebrating much later that night in every way possible. This won't be easy race, though. And even though the weather's going to be nice, this race will not be easy. But you know what? Now I have the race I want. The one that started it all. The 10K race. The one that made me even a more of a runner than what I am. 13 years later. <sighs> On September 17, 2011, exactly four months after my birthday, I started my running career, adult running career, five years after track and field days in high school. I was not eligible to go to college for, college, for track and field because I sucked. Hence being the slowest guy on the team. Well, now, now in 2011, 7, September 17th, I did my first ever adult race ever. It was not the 10K. It was actually the... It was actually the Air Force Weather Agency Corn Man Run. They did have a 10K, but it did the 5K. Exactly eight days later, on September 25th, 2011, I did my first ever 10K race in my entire life. The Omaha Marathon, Half Marathon, and 10K doesn't exist anymore. Long story short on that. 13 years later, I have done mile run, 5 mile, 5k, 10 mile, 10k of course, half marathon, and even the marathon, and 10 miles and all that, whatever. The only event that I have not PR'd in till to this day, unfortunately, is the 10k. Guys, this is the end of the challenge tomorrow, but if I end with a PR, oh, I'm going to scream. If I end with a trophy or a placing medal, I'm going to even scream even louder. Well, guys, we are now in the latter half. We are now officially in the latter half of my season. This is the fifth race of the season. The Summer Sizzler, 15K, 10K, 5K. I'm doing the 10K event. It is a circuit race as well, two-lap course. 15K does three laps, 10K does two, 5K just does the only one. Like Firecracker, eight mile race, four and eight mile race, this is also a circuit race and it's owned by the same company, Bodies Racing Company. Bodies, you gave me a PR automatically for the first time for the eight mile run. Now I'm hoping to get two with you with the 10K. This won't be an automatic PR since my time to beat was 103.10. Still to this day, I have not beaten my 10K time. Still haven't PR since I first did it, unfortunately. 
Every other race I PR'd except for this race. Two, the last time I did a 10K was two years ago. Well, guys, we are now officially in the latter half of my running season. I have four races down, three more to go for this whole season. This race, a race in August, and a race in September. But as far as this race goes, the final race of the challenge, the final of the three, the third and final race in July, my challenge, and of course on Olympic month, year, and of course, whatever you want to call it. Seven days, seven days, seven days, seven, 14, 21, you're the dragon. <sighs> Guys, I didn't think I'd make it this far. Well, tomorrow decides my fate and everything. Bros and babes, human balta didn't, wow. I overcame a lot to make it this far. And now, in about 18 hours from now, I'm running my final race of the challenge, my fifth race of the season, and the first race to start the latter half of my 2024 running season. Year of the Dragon may have not been the best year for 2024, but it was a good year for other reasons. Personal, professional, or running related, or even whatever else related. I overcame a lot. This wasn't easy. This wasn't fun. But I am now the Alex I should have been 20 years ago. Human Balta by nickname. Alex by government name. Running by my interest. Guys, there's nothing more to prove. Tomorrow is the last time and the last race, the anchor of the Olympic Challenge of my lifetime. Ta -da -da!